Welcome to the PinFlex tutorial on following and unfollowing boards and users. Now following boards and users is independent of your own boards. So even though PinFlex has all of your boards categorized up at the top here, you'll be following boards and following other users just under your main profile. So it doesn't really matter which uh, board you are uh, logged into or showing up at the top here. Okay. So for the first step, what you want to do is follow some boards. So we just click on the follow boards tab here, and then first go to settings. You can see that this is, right now it's blank because we haven't put any information in. So let's go to settings and let's find some uh, boards to follow for landscaping is our keyword here. And we will set auto follow uh, so that PinFlex will automatically follow the users it finds. Um, I am not going to automatically add to queue. I want to uh, curate the uh, the boards that I follow personally. So, and let's just set our starting time at 20 minutes and 30 minutes, so that we will be uh, following boards fairly quickly here. You can set this for longer if you want. If you only want to follow uh, a new board every day or so, you can do that as well. But I'm going to fill this one up quickly. Let's add our keyword and save the settings. Okay. Now let's check our search results and we can see that PinFlux has found uh, a variety of landscaping related boards here, but uh, not all of them are related to landscaping. So this is the reason why I wanted to curate myself. Uh, had I set uh, the settings to add to queue automatically here, uh, PinFlux would automatically choose this one here to follow as well. And I'm not going to add that to the queue or follow. But uh, for landscaping, here we go. This is more the type of thing that my client is looking for. So we'll just add to queue, add to queue, and uh, we'll just go through here and add a few more. And let's follow this one now rather than add to queue. We'll just do an instant follow. There we go. And we'll add a few more to queue. And Okay, so now what we can see here is the pending boards. These are all of the uh, boards that I selected that I added to queue. So these are all now lined up, and so long as we keep PinFlux turned on, PinFlux will automatically follow another one of those boards every 20 to 30 minutes. And over time, it will track our uh, our growth, and we can see here it's a pretty simple bar chart at this point. It's only showing one day and one follow, but this is the uh, uh, the one follow that we just did uh, manually. So over time, we'll see this bar chart fill out with more days and more followers. Now it's the exact same process for following users. Let's just tab over to follow user. Same deal here. We'll go to settings and let's put in landscaping and we'll add that keyword and again we will auto follow but again I want to curate these myself I don't want to add these to the queue automatically if you have a really highly targeted keyword then maybe you'll feel comfortable using the uh, the auto queue and again I'm gonna set my follow times very short here and go ahead and save settings and now we can take a look at the search results and same idea again here, not all of these are going to be related directly to landscaping, but uh, we can see that a few of them are definitely related to our niche. So we'll just scroll through here and try to find a few that seem to be related directly to landscaping. Okay, we'll follow that one immediately. And oh, a nursery, that sounds good. more landscaping okay so now if we look in our pending users we can see here are the uh, users that we have added to our queue and now PinFlux again as long as it remains running in the background will continue adding these users to our account uh, following them uh, every 20 to 30 minutes and again we can look at our follow growth and same deal here, we can see here one day, one follower. This is the one that we just did manually. And over time, we will see this bar graph uh, expand 
and show more detail. So that's basically how to follow boards and users. But now Pinflux also allows you to unfollow boards and unfollow users. So let's take a look at the boards first. To unfollow boards, first we'll go to our settings. Okay, and now this allows us to auto unfollow. And we can set the time span. Okay, again, we can allow it to check every 45 minutes to an hour. And we're going to set this here so that if anyone that we are following has not followed us back after say let's give them two days then pinflux will automatically unfollow them and we can also set other criteria here unfollow the board if the pins are less than uh let's say 20 pins and if their followers are less than 20 followers okay so this allows us to really uh, add a lot of followers quickly to our Pinterest account but then filter the boards that we have followed uh, with this unfollow filter and we'll go ahead and save those settings and now every 45 minutes to an hour Pinflux will check our boards that we're following and uh, eliminate any that have not followed us back in two days uh, or if their pins are less than 20 or their followers less than 20 okay now it's oh, we'll save those settings there we go now it's the exact same process for unfollowing users so we'll just go to the unfollow user tab here and again we'll uh, select the settings button and we will click auto unfollow and again we will check our times 45 minutes to an hour and unfollow if they have not followed us back after two days and save those settings and again it's the exact same process pinflux will check the users that we are following and any of those users that have not followed us back within two days we will automatically unfollow and that just allows us to keep our uh, our follow rates a little bit more balanced if you've ever seen uh, user accounts where they are following just massive amounts of users or boards um, but then not really getting a lot of follows back it makes those accounts seem a little bit less desirable to follow so by keeping uh, your unfollows balanced with your follows uh, it makes your profile a little bit more attractive to uh, potential followers and that's basically how to follow and unfollow boards and users with pinflux if you'd like to learn more tips and tricks on how to get the most out of Pinflux, please check out some of our other tutorials. Thanks very much for watching.